Good evening. Right, today we're just doing a wee daily vlog, day of the life, you know. Basically I couldn't think of anything else to do, so here we are. But you know what, I actually do have a lot planned today. I woke up this morning and looked outside, and you know what, it's like blue skies, which is kind of rare. Check the weather, 12 degrees. It's a day for the beach, I think. I texted my friend Susie, she's up for it. We're gonna go for a swim. We're just living like our best valley girl life. At this time of year, the... What sea is it? The... Oh my god, I have no idea. Is it the Atlantic Ocean? It could be the Irish Sea. Is that a sea? Did I just make that up? Anyway, one of the seas. It's really, really cold where I live. And like, it's just not a thing to go swimming in it. But like... Also, I hate the sea. So I don't know where I came up with this idea. I'm kind of melted though, because I do have to drive 40, 40 minutes to the beach. Oh, my life is so hard. Oh my God, speaking of driving, I have a few stories to tell you about my driving yesterday. So basically last night I was driving to get a sunbed. You know what, in assembly yesterday, our teacher was like, so next week we're having an assembly to teach everyone how to like take care of themselves properly and like keep themselves like safe from cancer and all, which includes appropriate sunbed use. And I was like, So in the car last night, and you know what song came on? Nice for what by Drake. And like I haven't listened to that song in about two years, but I was getting down. Like if you haven't listened to that song recently, go listen to it because it will change your life. It'll rock your world. And I was like in the car like this, and literally nearly crashed because I was just getting so into it. And it was like nighttime. There was no one else on the road. Like I was, I was giving it stacks. Like I was performing in the car. It was like you know when you get pushed into a dance circle and you're a bit shy at first, but then you just like really yeah. That was me in the car like in, while I was driving. So I was playing it full volume. So then I was like, right, if I crash here, would that still be playing? Because imagine it was like tears, blood, like my dead body, like all over the road. And then it was like, I want to care for my care. I want to care for my care for my care. I want to do for my dad for my dad for me. You know, like I think that'd be so much fun. I'll try that sometime. Also, yesterday was driving into school. Now my school is near the city centre, so it's an absolute nightmare to park. Like you will be driving around for 45 minutes to get a parking space, and that's if you're lucky enough to get a parking space. Most of the time, it ends up in tears because I don't know. Like when you're when you're driving around, stressed looking for a parking space, you start just having like seven mental breakdowns. Also, parallel parking. It's a no for me, not happening, not happening. Every single morning, who do you think I am? But yeah, so was driving around school, was looking for like 15 minutes, finally found a space, blessed, living life, free there. I knew something we were gonna get there. And be so wonderful. Oh, my neighbor just saw me. Okay. Oh, he's still there. Okay. Find a space, loving life, park, end of school, like fourth period, ring ring, the police, the police are on the phone. Basically, I had parked in front of this driveway. In my defense, it didn't look like a driveway. Like, who? I'm not salty about it, but anyway, it turns out there was a disabled person trying to get into it, so that was a bit grim. So anyway, I told my teacher, I was like, miss, I'm a fugitive, I need to leave school right now and go move my car, and she was like, go do your thing, Olivia. And <laughs> then it went down, the police had their guns pointed at me, like, it was a bit of like a Zach stop kind of situation. Zach, stop. Zach, stop. You're gonna get in trouble. Zach. I managed to escape and I moved my car. And that's the other story. I don't know, I just felt like a bit of a bad bitch. So I thought I'd tell you. Did I just call myself a bad bitch for parking in a disabled spot? Yeah. I don't, I don't know about that. Also, yeah, let's address the elephant in the room. I'm ugly, I have broad hair. So I'm not gonna talk about it and I don't wanna hear any fucking comments about it because I will cry myself to sleep. But yeah, it's brown. I'm being tested. Right, I have my bikini on underneath my clothes. I'm so excited. I'm not excited at all. Like, it's literally the least exciting thing. It's probably like, I'm probably actually really scared. If there's seaweed, abort mission. We're driving back home again. I don't care. Right, I need to go because I'm going for breakfast with Susie first and then we're gonna go to the beach. And I have so much to do today. We just need to get the show on the road. Oh my God, you know the Euphoria soundtrack got released recently, was it like today or last night or something? And like, oh, I love it. But like, it's not actually singing, but that one saw me. It's like, ah, ah, ah. I was driving down the road there to pick up Susie and I saw my dad's car. So I like drove up like right beside him and rang him so I could be like, haha, what you doing? And then I saw him look at me calling him, look back at the road and then just proceed to not answer. So my dad loves me. I'm living life and breathing air. 
like I need to stop singing the iCarly theme tune. Literally for the past two days, I've been driving Susie insane by singing the Jesse theme tune, but really badly. So I'll do it a lot today to get used to that. Anyway, let's just like get done the nice for what or something. I don't know. So my petrol light just came on. So this could be a bit of a problem. It's a problem that cannot be fixed. <laughs> I am literally terrified. Oh my god, there's loads of people. Oh my god, it looks disgusting. Is that all seaweed? Is that yeah. seaweed? <gasps> okay, so that girl's going in now. So I'm thinking if she can do it, so can we. Happy birthday, Raven. I can't swim. Happy birthday, Raven. I can't swim. We're gonna do some like summer vibing music, do a montage. Yeah. This is gonna be like kind of Jay and Alexis vibes. That didn't quite go to plan. I basically got in for like 30 seconds, nearly started crying because <laughs> there was so much seaweed and me and Susie carry me out again. <laughs> yeah, we'll definitely never do it again, but live life, breathe there. Hey, just say, oh, fuck ooh. Maybe it won't stop fucking singing this. It and feels it's like a party every it's like day. When you enter the of hell. Hey, just say. <laughs> it's supposed to be that high. Hey. I need to go get a shower now because I'm going to town with my mum and you stink and I stink and I probably have seaweed in places seaweed shouldn't be Shower time, Adderall, a glass of whiskey and diesel jeans Right, okay, so I went home and did my makeup and now I'm in the car with my mum We're on our way into town I did my makeup because I'm getting my dress fitting for my formal My formal's in less than two weeks and I'm stressed out about it Also, my dress is like silk satin kind of vibe so it shows every single thing you've eaten that day and I said I'd be really fit before formal and then do loads of exercise and be a skinny legend but because of my toe it's prohibited me from doing much exercise and I'm a fat bitch now but anyway we're over it and <laughs> um, mum liked that one <laughs> then I was like right let's just fill this day with fun activities also I'm not showing you my dress yet because I want it to be a bit of a surprise for my formal vlog mm -hmm. okay, so thinking let's do some fun things what's fun getting my ears pierced well actually I wouldn't I wanted to get my nipple pierced but mum said no so we're getting my ears pierced today I was thinking like here but anyway I'll check in when I'm actually getting it done I'm scared Right, back from town now. The sons have come over. Basically, I dyed their hair. I dyed their hair at the start of summer, and at this point, it's just kind of grown out and disgusting, and it's very yellow. So anyway, they got formal in two weeks, so they need to sort it out. So I'm gonna like tone it. Or Stop giggling at me. <laughs> also, I got my ear pierced, and they're like, I low-key kind of hate it because it's really low down and it kind of drips a wee bit. Susie's joined us. Uh, Your hair is. <laughs> hey Jesse. Hey Jesse. The worst singer ever. <laughs> I'm Daddy Pig! <laughs> oh my God. Can I just put some more in yours? Come back down here. I like rusty spoons. I like rusty spoons. And to talk to my shallow fingers. <laughs> Bits! <laughs> no. Look at that. No way, you're gonna dribble on me. Look, I just wanna be an inky book so I can tell them to fuck off. You've got spit in your chin. Yeah. <laughs> hey, to say. Oh, please, actually, I'm not gonna go to sleep tonight. So ah! 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 Oh yeah. Kind of good. It literally is awful. It looks the exact same. Why does it look like that? <laughs> Why does it look like that? <laughs> Why does it look like that? <laughs> I think it looks a bit lighter. No, it doesn't. It doesn't really. Okay, so I'm gonna lay in on a little secret here. It may be the next day. In fact, it is the next day. I just, I can't keep it in. I was guilt ridden. I was gonna pretend that it was the same day, but basically I don't do enough in my day to make it one vlog. So I decided to take you with me tonight. I'm going to an 18th. I just, it is 18th season. Like everyone is turning 18 at the minute, which means a lot of nights out, which is not good for me, especially because you know, my body does not cope well with the, with the booze. <laughs> yeah. 
shut up. Also, I have a family lunch tomorrow, which is bad news because I will be a corpse. I haven't even started getting ready and I'm already stressed. I ordered this um, pair of trousers of ASOS. Usually I'm like an eight or a six, depending on where it's from. So I was like, right, I'll order an eight just to be safe because I have child bearing hips. My hips are so wide. Why did I say that? <laughs> child bearing hips. I'm a creep. So then they arrived yesterday and I was planning on wearing them up tonight. So I hadn't even thought about another outfit. Tried them on, too fucking tight. Fucking mint, love that. Living life, breathing air. Stop singing the iCarly theme tune, Olivia. You know like when you have your first dance at your wedding? Mine's gonna be to the iCarly theme tune. So then because they didn't fit, I've asked my friend if I can borrow her trousers and she's coming to my house to let me try them on. But if they don't fit, I'm not going out. That's it. I'm having a wee night in to myself. Oh my God, and you know what I've decided, right? I think I'm psychic. Sorry, hear me out. My dad was driving down to Galway last week and I was in the car, obviously. And I was like, Dad, you're driving too quick. You're gonna get pulled over by the police. Sirens just begin as soon as I say it. Like, what on earth? So basically the psychic twins are shook. I really just like don't have time to be speaking. So I'll come back when my makeup's done. Oh my God, should I do a really cool transition? Transition, one, two, three. Oh, <laughs> that wasn't a very good spin. as I was doing my makeup, I get a text from my friend who's meant to bring the trousers saying she forgot them. So I'm literally unfriending her. I'm gonna go sit in this corner over here and cry for about 10 minutes and then I'll try to find an outfit. But like literally, Cornelia, if you're watching this, you're a stupid bitch because I am not, I don't have an outfit anymore. It's okay, right? Positive vibes only. Let's go attempt to find an outfit. This is going to end in tears. So I picked an outfit and I fucking hate it. Like I don't like it, but I don't have any other option at this point. I just feel like I look like a pimp in this jacket. Tell me what you think, except don't. I just have like these jeans with literally, is this a top? It's basically a bra, I feel so scandalous. Um, excuse me, why am I so burnt? It's not from sunbeds though, so I don't know why I suggest that. I think I was shot in the sun a bit too much the day before. So got a bit sunburnt. But then like this jacket, like, is it a look or not? I don't think it is. I was just in the shower there. I had a shower with my makeup on, which is a bit creepy, but like, so I have really hairy arms, but it doesn't just stop at my arms. It goes onto my hands. It's just like, it's not for me. Like it might be for you, but hairy hands is not my preference. So I decided to shave it there and I completely made myself bleed. So that's a bit of a look. Also, I have a liter bottle, which is not happening. Like obviously not, but like, what? it could be a messy one, right? Off we go to the pre. Scared. Woke up in the morning around six. Two dark bitches on my side like Twix. Hey, little vanilla in the mix. Don't eat ass, but I'm still with the shits. Ooh, playing badminton with your sister or your main boo. Riding in the Fisker or the goddamn day woo. Side bitch driving cause I'm lit off the Quaaludes. Thanksgiving Eve, that was just the prelude. Ooh, that's the prelude. Mr. Clean was the debut. Uh, yeah, I'm riding in the day woo. What's your main boo? Gravy train. All these hoes forget me thoughts. Forget me 